Immunotherapy and prostate cancer is a complex topic. Um, you know, it has, of the GU malignancies that we treat, prostate cancer has been the, um, you know, most resistant to sort of experiencing those responses to immunotherapy that, you know, we see in our patients with, you know, renal cell carcinoma or urothelial carcinoma. Um, however, um, there are some strategies um, which have been looked at to sort of sensitize um, the local tumor microenvironment um, for prostate cancer to try to figure out how to get T cells to infiltrate that space better or to sort of make the prostate cancer cells seem you know more visible to the immune system and so combination therapies um, using you know vaccines for instance plus immunotherapy being looked at um, there are multiple NIH studies looking at that sort of approach um, there are large studies looking at the addition of immunotherapy to androgen targeted agents so for instance the keynote 199 trial is looking at the addition of pembrolizumab to enzalutamide. Um, this is in patients with metastatic castrate-resistant prostate cancer. So there are, those are questions that we're continuing to ask, and we hope that we'll be able to find a way to select patients who, you know, may have prostate cancer, which could respond to immunotherapy.